All right, first time doing this, going to try to talk you all through my uh, edit system here. I've already edited one photo. I'm just going to try to kind of copy that from the beginning now. So we got finished raw straight out of uh, my Fujifilm on a tripod. Normally just to get started, I do hit auto just to kind of get the jump on things. I can pull my shadows back a little bit, not shadow, exposure back a little bit. See what else we got here. I like my little images a little darker and then pull them out in the shadows. So let's see what we got. I think it was 74. Normally hold down my option button when clicking on the whites and blacks. This kind of helps show you if there's too much white, something overexposed. Whenever you see this, too much. I'm going to cut it back so you don't see the color there for the whites. Black's a little different. You can see a little bit of black. It'll be alright. Boom. Just kind of pick the taste there. Then I uh, so looking over this. I think my got kind of an orange hue to it. I'm going to change up the white balance there. If that works for you, great, go for it. But I kinda like the uh kinda like the blue a little bit better. Got that there. See what else needs to be done. I mean sometimes you can go ahead and edit blues, bring out the blues. You know, I, don't, I don't like the look of that for this one quite that much. So you can just it's crazy how much you can do with this stuff here. Gonna increase the sharpening. You don't want to overkill. This might be overkill for other people, but um, this is what I've been doing, so I've just been sticking with it. See if that changes anything dramatically, not too much, so I'll just leave it there. And this is the fun part here. These are the profiles that come with uh, Fujifilm. Make it black and white. Super vivid, not a big fan. Uh, this one's pretty cool for city stuff kind of brickwork pretty sweet things will run slow here but um, we're just going to stick with the classic Provia see the difference here boom then I'm going to make it Instagram friendly which is this right here so now we're done. What we're gonna do? I'm gonna move it to my Instagram folder. It's actually already in there. Well, Instagram. This